Welcome back Bean Crypto. In today's video, we're going to be looking at Dogecoin to Bitcoin here on the Bittrex Trading View chart. As you guys can see, tons of information is being displayed here. We will dive in and discuss what exactly is going on onto here and answer the question, will we be breaking out and breaking upwards fairly soon and in the near future will be hitting all-time highs will we not be hitting all-time highs will we just be seeing a breakout to the outside these questions will be answered in today's video and now if you guys are new to the channel definitely make sure to subscribe turn on post notifications leave a giant thumbs up we'll be answering the question whether or not we'll be breaking to the upside in the near future on dogecoin also huge shout out to our continued sponsor on the channel storm game basically don't let your crypto sit exactly what it says make it earn 10 percent yearly interest for you you can basically deposit money in to your account as low as $100 USD and you'll basically uh, incur interest on your investment into their platform which is pretty awesome tons of information displayed here all frequently asked questions to ensure safety definitely check them out it is the first link in the description of today's video otherwise let's jump into today's episode So a ton of information is being displayed right now on the Dogecoin to Bitcoin one week Bittrex chart. And I wanna discuss with you briefly as to what it is that we're looking at. Now, for those of you who have never seen this right here, this is what we call the sign line right here that is used to basically show wave patterns within the cryptocurrency. Now we know that Dogecoin has had some very intricate patterns happening that I would like to discuss with you guys in, in depth more so than what we've been seeing. And I wanna point out an interesting pattern that we haven't seen in quite some time now. So if we go back and look at previous history, this is 2015, 2016, you'll notice the way the patterns form is we usually break downwards into some sort uh, of the bottom of the sign line right here. We fall into the bottom wave. You notice right here, we fall into the bottom wave. Now what I wanna point out is right here, notice the difference that has happened right here. Previous to this, we decided to break down, but we did not fall downwards similar to here or here and then break back upwards. We just managed to trend through here and then hit the bottom on the next one. And it seems like every time we hit the bottom on the next one, we tend to break up. This was the all time high for Dogecoin. We broke bullish. Now continue further. You'll notice we had another breakdown. Then we shot up, we break down, we shot up right here. We break down again, we shot up, but look right here. We tend to do the same thing we saw back in, I believe this was 2016, where we trend right through it. We trend right through it. Now, another thing is you'll notice behind that is that major descending triangle in purple, which is another indicator that we could be breaking to the upside, a bullish indicator to the upside. But I'm really trying to focus right now on the weekly is that we trend through here and we trend through here. We did not fall back down into here and then pop up we tend to trend right through it and then hit a bottom support on the next one. You can see we trended right through it and then we hit a bottom support on the next one. You'll notice the immediate run right after that is to an all time high, this major move to the upside. Is it possible that because we broke right through here and that we're hitting the bottom, we could see another major move to the all time high? I don't wanna say an all time high, but we could be seeing a potential breakout. We could be seeing another swing. We could be hitting, you know, resistance up here um, at previous, you know, highs that we've had in 2018, maybe not the all time high, but previous highs that we've had. And if this pattern does hold out, we could be seeing that breakout happen. This is definitely an opportunity. We look okay on the RSI. We look okay on the weekly. We did see a previous bullish cross on the weekly MACD. So there are a lot of signals that show this pattern happening. Now I wanna just jump in into the daily to show you guys more specifically what exactly is uh, I'm referring to. You'll notice every time in the past of 2016, we tend to break bearish, we break down, and then we swing back up. We break down, we swing back up, we break down, we swing back up. This time we trended right through it, then we break up massive, massive, massive highs. We do the same thing, the same pattern happens. We fall, we go up, we fall again. This time we trended right through it. No swing upwards. This may be right here, right around this time period, the indicator of a swing to the upside to pretty big highs. You'll notice on the MACD, if I just zoom into here to show you guys what exactly we're looking at, you'll notice a couple of interesting patterns. You'll notice right here, let me zoom in, that we're seeing a very interesting cross right here. We're seeing, let me zoom in on that, a very interesting bounce off of what could have been a resistance, but is now starting to form some sort of bullish uh, move, some bullish cross 
you know, a bounce right here, we're starting to head up, which is a great sign in regards that we could be starting to see that uprising within uh, Dogecoin. Now, I do want to also continue, uh, consider showing you guys that we are seeing some sort of pattern right here. Let me see if I can move this lower. There we go. So notice when I move that lower, what we're looking at right now is that there is some sort of immediate major descending triangle that's forming. We have support down here as well as support over here, some sort of channel, but we're bounced off this one, which pretty much shows us that this is the support we we're looking at. We're getting intertwined with the high low middle moving averages you can see off this downtrend we could break at a substantial rate the end of a descending triangle tends to usually break to the upside so we could be seeing a major 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 bull run we can kind of figure out where exactly the price goes if we use something called a fibonacci retracement we get from the point of breakout right to here and we then extend this over to where we are right now let me do that and you can see what exactly we're looking for right here so let me just move this right here extend this out right here so this is what we're looking for we can anticipate some sort of region as to this height right here in between the yellow and the green that's usually where i tend to buy off or sell out this is about the average zone we could easily see a high previous to when we decided to start this descending triangle but we could be expecting to see a major break within dogecoin now i know we haven't seen these and usually when we see lower and lower and lower volume we eventually tend to break out with extreme force and that may be reciprocated here within dogecoin in the next couple couple of days if not a week or so and that's the really big point that I wanted to discuss with you guys the fact that this sine wave right here that we can see right here definitely something I would continue to use or consider using does tend to hold truth right here and the fact that we kind of just trended right through here may inference that we could be seeing a breakout fairly soon let me just swing this a little bit over but you can see for the most part, that's what we're anticipating. The fact that we just trended right through here with no sort of consolidation may indicate that we could be seeing a big breakout to the upside. Otherwise, guys, we do have articles posted on B and Crypto for this technical analysis right here. If you want to learn more about this and you want to get more in-depth analysis, definitely make sure to check that out. It will be the first link in the description. Otherwise, I will see you in the next video. Peace.